Welcome back to the channel, Siano Gaming are back with yet another video. So in today's video, I bring to you guys an amazing series. We actually aim to claim Southgate over on Extinction. It's going to be a big series for you guys. Hopefully you guys are excited. But before we do get into the video, let me talk about Ike My Trike Fibercraft is wiping July 8th at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. They are actually merging with Dreamy Fibercraft, so it's all re-wiping. They also feature a $300 cash prize. Their tribe limit is 10. One alliance harvest is 100 times. They have instant tame, insta level, auto unlock, ingrams, level is 300, wild tames, dinos, whatever you want to consider it, custom caves, custom spawns, BPS currency. They have every map they also do events every weekend very active admins as well join the link in the discord and in the pinned comment and i will be playing i hope to see you guys there the goal was to claim one of the best rattles on extinction in one of my opinions southgate so we're going to be a duo it's going to be me and the bozo of course so we're going to do this we're going to level up we're going to craft some things honestly we're going to do a note run but on this server that i was playing you kind of got XP pretty fast, so honestly, I just wanted to get over there and spam it because I knew it would be highly contested. Also, bear in mind, there was a few issues with the server starting out. The health was not leveling right, dino weight was all glitched, and ORP was on. So it took the um, owner and admins a little while to fix some of this. The ORP actually ended up staying on, though, for the first few days because we actually, nobody could play after the first day because this is as soon as that update hit where... Arc decided to screw all Windows 10 players and had that weird update, hack, whatever. So we couldn't play for like the first few days, but then they also, the admins on the server made it right. They gave everybody a PC pack if you're a PC player because we were days behind. We had, um, the first day though, we got enough to where our base was pretty secure. So it's going to be a good wipe. Hopefully we can make this a long one for you guys. Stay tuned. Now let's get up there and see if we can get this cave claimed. So we ended up managing to be the first person to actually get a few foundations spammed, but barely because we do get into a little bit of PvP. It was definitely a little bit of a heftic one. Also not used to numbers on server. Let me know if you guys do like like numbers being on certain servers. I feel like it might cause lag, but it was definitely a different thing and I'm not going to complain. You know, every once in a while, trying something different never hurts. So having the numbers on was different, but honestly, it is what it is, you know. It's not the worst thing in the world, but let's get this built up. Let's get into a little bit of PvP, and hopefully we can secure this enough to where nobody can blow in. So at this point, with us having it spammed off a little bit, I knew we'd have a little bit of time. I know they can leave uh, lead corrupted dinos over and destroy these, but at least the inside ones, they need to get an Arthur or C4. So we're going to spam off a bunch of foundations, but then we need to get heavies ASAP. Also get like, I don't even care if it's a low level Therizino, you know, Rhino, something at the entrance to defend a little bit if they do try to rush in with rockets. Because even like a heavy or two, if somebody gets a good enough shield and their tribe mate runs behind them, there is an opportunity for them to run behind it and blow our turrets so let's get this spammed off once the servers i guess crash and come back up let's get it spammed up let's get this figured out let's try to get heavy turrets
Like I said, RP was not supposed to be on at the time, but it was definitely annoying because if somebody died and their bag turned into, or if they like, yeah, if they logged out or if like their player became a bag, you couldn't access it. So it's definitely annoying, but um, it also turned out in the end because of, you know, what happened with the update and stuff later on this night. But um, yeah, we got into quite a bit of PvP, which was nice. Um, Southgate was definitely highly contested, and I was solo at the time, so I think I pulled it off. The bozo gets on in a few hours after work, but um, I held it down. Now that it's uh, spammed off, all we gotta do is get turrets, at least a couple heavies at the entrance, and I think we'd be all right. So it's kind of stressful because I need to get this done like ASAP. They also took down the servers a few times. That's why you keep seeing the thing at the top. Um, just fixing a couple few issues, which you know it happens to all servers. I'm not gonna hate on it, but um, it's definitely a little annoying at times. But hey, you know they fixed it in the end. So let's get back. Let's get some farming done, let's get some PvP done, and see what we can figure out, and hopefully we can go get some heavies done pretty quick. One thing I was not intending for is like spiders and things to actually spiders and things that actually spawn in the area. I don't know why I wasn't counting on that. We need to get a PT, but it's like everything just kept jumping us. But let's try to get a few PTs tamed. Let's get some of this stuff killed out of the way. Uh, there's always the annoying stuff like pegomastics, birds, raptors that come out of anywhere. They can hear you across the map and they're going to be like, oh, you're taming now. Yeah, it's gangbanging. I'll wait. I don't even sound right. <laughs> yeah, with that being said, let's get some Tranodons. Let's get this stuff tamed. Let's deal with a bunch of things. And yes, go try to get some heavies up. That's the main goal. We got to get heavies. We got to get Tranodons. Could use a Therizino, Velo, something to also put in there. Mantis would be really clutch right now, but I ain't got the time to go do that until Bozo gets on. There's so much shit, they just don't want me to get nothing done. I'm more worried about the dinos than I am the people at this point, holy hell. Well, I'll be dang, looky there. We just hit level 100. So now that we're level 100, we need to get electronics, metal. We also need some tames. Let's get these turrets up. I'm going to spam all of these off of foundations as quick as I can, just so nobody could pull up, or if they pull up, they have to do a lot of work. 
him over center for a quick run i need to get a few drops because i know white has like primitive flak and crossbow and stuff in there and you know extinction don't have drops like this and i also want to tame up a quick tranodon and get that stuff going and then we'll transfer back and our base should be safe like i think i'm pretty confident at this point i don't think anybody's gonna mess with it we got quite a bit of spam quite a bit of this they'd have to go tame an arthro and even then i should be back with a time the levels are also quite weird that does get fixed so don't worry about that they all get adjusted later on We have taken flight, so we're gonna go over, we're gonna get a few drops, we're going to farm up a little bit, and yeah, hopefully if we can get a few drops, we can get some primitive flak and crossbows and stuff. It'll help with taming, also flak is just gonna be nice because, you know, everybody's running around with torches and just regular bows right now, you know, and there's still people that keep coming back to the rat hole over there. There is a tribe of two that is really pissed off that I'm in that spot, so we're gonna have to deal with them for a little while. We'll see how it goes. Let's get some of these drops and see how the drops are. And let's farm up as much as we can while we're over here real quick. Wow. I'm gonna tame up a quick parasaur because a quick parasaur would help with a lot of issues over there. I can throw it out inside while I'm doing stuff, while I'm farming around the area or while I'm inside building and then it'll let me know where the people are outside so I know where they are so I can go out there, you know, kill them, whatnot. And then if we get a Therizino or something at that entrance and get like two, three heavies, I think we'll be good for a little bit to actually get some bigger farming done like head over to Crystal and all those other places. Found this theory and honestly I don't even care the level we're just going to tame it up because anything will be better than nothing I mean we have it there and we can just literally sit there at that small entrance knocking people back should be good so let's try to get this in here let's try to get this knocked out real quick and hopefully not get killed by them because they're insanely broken and OP at times. definitely need to grab this like we actually found one beaver dam i will take it and it even has electronics in it never really see that too much on a server like this but um i will take it so definitely know to get the beaver dams if i see them so find a beaver dam let's get ready to head back to base maybe grab a few more drops
we actually got a pretty decent long neck at the beginning you know it's only a apprentice but um now i'm just getting completely destroyed i was gonna try to risk and grab that beaver dam but as you can tell i'm almost dead so we gotta get out of here we gotta dip there's so much stuff after me like i swear i've had more times of almost dying by the pve side of this game in this video than i did the pvp everything was trying to kill me i mean there's so much i don't know what i was thinking about swimming down in a swamp without much oxygen or movement speed but hey we made it out that's all that matters so let's get out of here we need to go back to our home map We are back over at our map and everything's looking good. We're going to start setting this space up. It's and yes, I know the tickly chicken is super low level. I do understand that. But anything at this little entrance right here, if we get like one heavy turret and I have the theory here just to kind of defend and knock back anybody that tries to rocket run or anything, it will help. I mean, level 19 pretty crap but um you know it, it'll do we also have a parasaur now we could throw out so we need to get the fabricator we need to get the smithy up the fabricator we need to get some turrets going asap we need to go out we need to kill some enforcers get some electronics we have the um refining forge the smithy pretty much almost everything we need we need metal and uh, electronics especially we're gonna need to have to get more cement paste and all that so so far the wipe is going pretty well if you guys did not see the last video make sure you guys go check it out we actually pvp'd quite a bit for this spot we ended up claiming it the tribe is going to be joining us really soon when i say tribe i meant the bozo with that being said you'll see what we can get done it is time we actually got the fabricator crafted up so we're gonna make the fabricator we're gonna place it we're gonna work on electronics preferably probably need to go farm some enforcers too because it'll make things a lot quicker and we can make flame arrows pretty cheap on here i think compared to what they normally are um so if we make flame arrows with a crossbow we should be able to probably kill the enforcers pretty quick i know they're not like mantises mantises die like instantly by the cro uh, the flame arrows but still be better than nothing we'll try it we'll try our luck we just need to get a couple hundred um electronics going so we can make that first heavy and then i'll feel a little bit more safe but with that being said, I'm going to speed a little bit of this up, maybe play some music in the background for you guys, just so you guys don't have to watch every bit of it. But I also do guys want to show you guys like the build up, the journey, what happens. I try to like include a little bit of everything, a little bit of PvP, a little bit of the build up, what happens for the day and all that. So I'm going to speed it up so you guys don't have to see all the boring stuff, skip around. And all with that being said, make sure you guys go like the video. So we're back to base. The metal is coming along pretty nicely. I mean, it's melting up. I wish it was melting up a little bit quicker, 
but we did get some polymer while we were out. We have electronics, we have cementing paste, and we should have everything that we need to make that first heavy turret, which feels so nice. We gotta make the generator, get gas going. We gotta just get this set up ASAP. We need to get some advanced bullets. Um, it's gonna feel so much better having this there. I know one heavy isn't a lot, but for me, the bozo wasn't able to make it on like the first like hour or so. I think it was like the first two hours of wipe because of work. So I was kind of stressing a little bit because there was a quite a few tribes um, like the first like 30 minutes over here trying to claim this spot. Thankfully, I was able to PvP, get the spot spammed off and claim it. So this is honestly a big relief for me to actually get a heavy turret up. And it just makes me feel a lot more secure here. Even though I know we still have a lot to do. Our goal was to build a couple nice big shandies outside also build a thick wall and just live and extinction um rat hole and just live on extinction in general do some osds that's the goal for the wipe we even may take a better spot later on for a lot more room to breed and all that as well but we'll see what does happen i know the series was one of my favorite series to actually record for you guys so i hope you guys do enjoy it i know there's a few small things that are annoying like yes the numbers occasionally for me at least not the biggest fan of them, but I did get used to them. It was something different. But overall, I had a blast on the server. I had fun. So I hopefully you guys do enjoy this series. Alright, another heavy to add to the small little wall over here, if that's what you want to call it. So, now we're getting somewhere, probably like 3-4 heavies, I would say, with the flak and everything early game, the first few hours. Nobody's going to be able to really run this, even if it's multiple people, in my opinion. But, having a few heavies down, I feel a little better. Definitely need to get this wall started. I know um, the bozo said that he had a pretty good build that he wants to build. So I might not do too much, but I might try to floor it out the best that I can outside and start spamming. Get some of the turrets at least placed and then I'll probably let him build the inside since he seems pretty confident on building it. So if it looks like shit, definitely blame him. Nah, I'm just missing. Don't, don't be too harsh, you know. Not everybody builds here too often, but with that being said, let's see what we can get into all the shenanigans that are about to happen. I mean, the dude was stacked in its own little way. I mean, we got a okay trike saddle BP and, you know, he got a lot of hatchets and things on him. But, um, I mean, the trike BP could be useful later on. We got some cementy paste, some metal. We even got some more crossbows. So, I guess the two heavies it did come in handy, but we definitely need to get more down because we don't even have much ammo. They have like 40, 50, uh, uh 40, 50 shots per, um, turret. So, we definitely got to get that changed get a couple hundred at least and get like four or five heavies there but yeah this is like one of the tribes that wanted this spot and there's a few more that just continue to try to get this spot so we're gonna try to defend it the best that we can and hope that the bozo hurries up and gets home and gets on and actually helps us get things done
I know a lot of people think this is pretty scummy to do, but honestly, it is what it is. It helps us. The server doesn't have a ban. Most servers do have a ban, but you know, it ain't banned, so I'm gonna do what every other person is doing to their base. I am going to take these a electrical, vertical, whatever you wanna call it, electrical cables, and uh, I'm going to spam the entrance. I mean, they can still orbital camera and stuff. It just makes it more annoying to try to like rock and run and get through here when you can't really see what you're doing unless you orbital camera. So I know you guys can think it's kind of a scummy thing to do, but y'all know you would do the same thing if the server actually allows it because you know, it's helping defending your base. So it was allowed, took advantage of it, and I did that. So whoop de doo cry me a river. Uh, you know what I'm crying about though? Not having no goddamn ammo in my turrets. It's making me depressed. Bozo, where are you? We need the ammo. No, I'm just playing. He'll be on shortly. We're going to get him added up. Well, we came over to the center because honestly, in my opinion, it's one of the better maps to get metal besides like Aberration and Crystal Isles. So I'm just trying to stay hidden. I have a mining drill. I'm going to farm up a bunch of these nodes. So it'll get us a decent amount of metal quickly to get started. Another reason I came over here, I can quickly do this. I can quickly get to a drop and I can quickly get back to the base over on Southgate or on Extinction because a lot of people have been messing with it. But we definitely need metal. We need flint. We need to get things going for ammo, for more turrets, to get the stuff flared out we want to like ocd spam the entire outside as well into metal eventually so i'm gonna get all the metal smelted up farmed up then smelted up and hopefully we can get a lot of things done We brought back a lot of metal. Um, the stack sizes do eventually do get fixed. They just stack so dang high, so it don't even look like you have much. But we also need a bunch more forges. So we need to get the industrial forge up. But for the meantime, I'm gonna place a bunch more forges, split up this metal, get the metal going, just to make it a little bit quicker. From the get-go, honestly, you should always place like 10 minimum forges. I should have had them going a lot quicker. It would have progressed as a lot more. But at the same time, I was also working on defending, PvPing, getting tames, a couple heavies up. It was just it was just all on one person to get this spot. But I think we did pretty good. Um, with that being said, let me know how you guys would build the wall in the comments below. Would you guys use like pillars, door frames? Would you use a cliff plat? Because we don't use cliff plats because a lot of people tell me people can kind of like hit the cliff plats through the sides even if they're not sticking through. So we went ahead and later on we do floor it out. So just let me know the best way to actually build this in the comments below and your guys' opinions whether it's with pillars, double door frames for like the walls and stuff or if it's just use cliff plats and then build the wall on that because I wasn't really sure about that but we do it do it the way of spamming out the bottom later on.
All right, okay, first yeah. things that we're going to do is tame this griffin. I know it's kind of a low level, but I need anything quicker to get around. I definitely got to keep an eye on the extinction base because the bozo yet again is still not on. He'll be on in a little bit. So we're going to get it started. We're going to get built. We also have an issue where the update for Windows 10, whatever you want to call it, causes the entire server to go down for three days. Only Xbox players were able to play later on. So you'll see what happens with that. They do kind of make it right for some of us because we were doing so well but we also have some issues with an admin or somebody that got the admin code i'm not exactly sure but it does become an issue so i'll explain more later on when that actually happens but let's get this low level griffin tamed up We got an okay um, carbo saddle. It's not the greatest, but it'll do. We also got the griffin tamed up. It didn't come out with, you know, the best stats. It's level 29. Honestly, with infinite weight, I'm just going to put a point into weight. All stam and just use it to get around scout. We need to go get some wyvern eggs. We got to kill some things in extinction to get some more polymer right now. Just some quickly easy polymer. We also need to get some more electronics. So let's go do that now. And I know there's so much better ways to get polymer later. We just go kill some mantises and stuff. But um, like the BKs and everything were just contested this early on. Everybody was getting all that stuff. And I didn't feel like dealing with the abs. So I just need a little bit to make a few turrets. Mantis, holy crap. Guys, switch. Oh shit, 1300 organic polymer. I got 2700 polymer. That, makes that was from, much. yeah, that was from two mantises. Chainsaw came in clutch because I don't know if I can find any more. I've went through this whole desert. Like, that's so cool. Well, oh, it's an RV though, too. Oh, no, 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 don't tame it with that. Like, that sucks. I hope they fix that offline timer shit real quick because. Like I could I could blow into this and get some early game shit. Damn. 
Alright, we got industrial forge. If I grab spark, I can make a chem bench too. Yeah, if you want. Can you craft me mining drill and a chainsaw as well? Uh, chainsaw, mining drill, chem bench. I can make one more head and I'm gonna wait for that. Yeah, what I want, what I want is, uh... Oh, bro, that's so annoying. That was not the color of the Vivo. It still looks cool. I mean, it is, but bro, this was like really, really white. You'll see it in the video once I get this shit edited, but Here. that is, that is so... Oh, thanks. Like, that's kind of annoying. I mean, it's still level 5 Vivo, still a cloner either way. Dun, 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 dun. Gotta put some of this up. This is just to get to me, get me to the area. Bro, I Jordan. can't, I can't do it. I found a level 20 lightning wyvern egg, but I'm not grabbing it. I'm not getting the whole crew on me for a level 20. Ain't happening. Or a lightning 165, I'm risking this griffin. Yeet. Aw, oh, bro, griffin, you might, you might be bait. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Don't mind if I do for 165 lightning. You know, it's not the 190 you called for, but um, 165 for pretty good. Level. 165 is pretty damn good. Yeah, it is. I'm gonna go upload it, and I'm gonna go back and check some more. Yeah, dude, it came out with 275 million. It's one. It's the little mega theriums, little mega 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 Oh mega yeah. Monkey. Yep. It's nice. Got a little monkey that'll do some DPS, throw some shit at some people. Bro, is that a wyvern coming from me still? Oh, bro, should I get a level 85 lightning? No, 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 no. Don't even pick that up. Unless, the only way... You I was thinking for breeding, maybe, if it was the opposite gender. I still wouldn't personally pick it up, honestly. Just go for high level ones right now. And when we get more of a better team like tames, then pick them all up just so they respawn. But for right now, fuck it. Just pick up the good ones. That's another 85. Fifteen, nope. Can't be asked, man. Can't be asked. 85? There's a lot of 85s in here. It was a 180 poison. I got all these wyverns after me. I got 700 health on this. You know, I can't. I can't leave 180, man. I can't. I can't. Cause it's not gonna be here when this shit comes back up. You have to go for it. Oh, 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 shit. Oh, dodge, dodge, weave, dip. You can dodge a wrench, you can dodge a ball. Oh, shit, one minute. I hope it's, it's good to the drop. All right, so we're going to go ahead and set up the wall a little bit. I'm actually very impressed at how flush I actually got this. I don't really know if this is the best way to build the wall. Um, I'm probably a little too close with it but we're gonna have some big skeletals and stuff outside as well so we're gonna get this place and see how that goes
So I know some of you are probably wondering how we did get the replicator and all of that. Um, so because we were not able to get on for three days and Xbox players were playing the entire time, the server did like a PC bundle pack which came with a few tech turrets, a tech rep, and a couple things to get us started as some tames as well. That's how we have stegos. And we, I did do the boss fights ahead of time, but the servers went back. And then we also ended up getting red gunned by this guy right here. So the servers had to be backed up again. Again. so yeah somehow he got the admin passcode uh, something happened we got red gunned it is what it is it moves on now let's get the building let's get the breeding let's get stuff done So that was to try to make the bozo. If you're wondering why I blocked him in like that, because that's his new character. He actually lost his other character when the servers went down. All of our stuff and upload, everything got deleted because it was like three days and, you know, clearly the timer's still going to go down. So he made another character and I got to invite him when he does get on. They're going to floor this out. Time War, Time War is the number one easy craft server that features 25 harvest in a 10 man tribes. They wipe the first, which is this coming Saturday, and I will be playing on this wipe, so I hope to see you guys there. They have a huge population of wipe that play and have active admins to help you with any issues. They feature a lot of special things like custom drops, custom caves, so you can get the perfect base spot for you. Join the Discord linked in the description and in the pinned comment. I hope to see you guys there on the first. Alright, so starting the day off, we're going to hatch up some teams. We got a ton of things going on. We like we have some pretty decent velos. We're trying to get the good stats. I got the good health, not the good melee. We also have 8.3k stegos. I want to raise some of those up. We need to get all that going because we have a few raids coming up 
that we're aiming to raid and also aiming to take over a spot as well which will give us a lot more room for breeding and all that and if there is a base in that we are definitely going to attempt to raid it it's gonna be it's gonna be pretty bad like it's gonna take us a while if there is a base set up because it's one of the better spots on here but we're gonna give it a shot if nobody's it built in it then we're just gonna take it over which i highly doubt it because it's a popular spot but with that being said yes because some of this raised up i'm gonna speed through some of it we're gonna do a little bit of re uh raising um some of our tames we also got to organize some of this like i want to do some floating dinos and stuff in here as well to try to make it more organized if we can we also need to get ready to do a, an event later on as well yeah, we're trying to combine the stats like we have 3.6k um health so we're really trying to get that on the melee the 355 which is pretty good of velos like it's gonna help us run lava golem i also want to get some spread out like throughout the base we're also going to try to do a chandelier tomorrow we're going to farm up and craft all the resources that we need today and attempt to build that tomorrow our first big chandelier outside or not chandelier skeleton tower plus the chandelier but the skeleton tower the first main one is what we're really focusing on so we can get that down we're probably going to have some other towers just kind of thrown around because i don't want somebody to attempt to mesh it i know there's that like mesh little rat hole down below the pelagornis spot so really got to prevent anybody from you know doing stuff like that i know it's banned on servers but that don't stop people from cheating and doing a bunch of other stuff so we're going to get back into hatching some things up raising some things up we're definitely going to need to keep up on berries and meat and hopefully we can get a bunch of stuff raised up so we actually have teams around the base that's imprinted to us So laggy. Wait, my whole kit disappeared. It's cause it's lagging, bro. No, like I spawned in and like, oh, okay, you you right. I know I'm right. You Man, I need a very nice word. I'm gonna go cry. Bro, how do I know who if it's you? Like, <laughs> I'm the only one over here right now. Everybody else is dead. <laughs> That's oh, is you that you right there? We should yep. try upside. No. You get anything good? Is this you? Yeah, yeah, I'm running up, I'm running up. Alright, alright, invite, invite, there you go. Quickly recruit. Oh, oh wait, that's the admin, alright. Hey, comp BP. Where's everybody at? <laughs> Did you really kill them all already? Yeah. <laughs> wait, somebody down, down? There's somebody down? jumping so much oh damn how'd you one tap me i had a full flack on you killed me <laughs> bruh how did you kill me like that i had like our crafted vps on like brand new fight who's parachuting away Bruh. I'm running up naked. Dude, you ran into the water. Wait, who you popped a giga? You can have a giga? 
I don't know how the fuck I killed you, but I killed you. Bro, go, go. There's a dude on a Giga. I didn't think there was a lot of teams. Actually, I might run up there naked and try to grab a couple things. Is there any drops still coming? Yeah, red. Did I you? Fucking threw the Giga away a little bit. Did you get anything good? Uh, let me check. Because if you got anything good, I would just go ahead and dip. I got another flamethrower BP, flippers BP, and hazmat helmet BP, which is nice for gas. Mm-hmm. Especially if anybody's built in the one cave on crystal and such. Other than that, I got a whole bunch of, like, ammo and shit. Better than nothing. Yeah, ma. Oh, you was? Yeah, I literally comboed a different person, but the, I missed what's, it. I what's, what's Golem Dodgeball? I don't know. So I'm <laughs> assuming you gotta dodge the fucking... Bro, I don't have flak though, which is like... What? It's like, it's kind of like that fucking soccer thing he did. Dude, I really wish I wasn't at work, bro. I bet you that oh, was Oh, yeah, I got flak actually. Let me put this on. I don't need a chest, bro. I'm still grabbing drops. I don't even care about these people. I got prim flak on now, but there's a there's a giga just chilling there, and I'm just grabbing shit like he's not even here. Oh, bro, I got it. My tier one win. I don't really care. All the it all depends on what the tier one is. The first round win. Alright, let me craft up a shotgun, shotgun. I got a level 6 cloner stego too, by the way. Good shit. Just came it right outside. Shotguns came out, one can't- oh shit. Uh, then we got polymer. That one only came out at 240. The other came out at three something. So what's cap on here? I don't know. I was thinking I needed to get ascendant ones, but they were just so damn expensive. Three three three. So wait, we can go over three three three. I don't know. That one's the three three three. So maybe I should have got. I don't know. Fuck it. Our durability on our some of our flak is coming out around 1400 to 1100, 600, 800, 900, nice. 650. Uh, long necks. Well, damn, that one came out at 171. I mean, it's not the greatest, but for how shitty the BP is, 173. Nice. So we got a 303 and a 333 shotgun. We got a 324 sniper and a one crossbow came out at 303, the other came out at 202. Or 250, I mean, so not bad. I give you that shotgun. I will give you the good crossbow. There's that. Alright, uh, we need shotgun ammo, don't we? I have shotgun ammo. Do you have enough? Yeah, there's a lot in the. Uh, oh, yeah, I forget we have some over there. I'm not gonna take my long neck with me though. Plus, I fucking got a bunch of when we ran the uh, drop party. Oh, yeah. Alright, let me mind wipe my character. The numbers are throwing me off. I'm not used to that shit. Yeah, me either. I mean, it's different, but I don't know how I feel about it. I don't mind it, but at the same time, it's kind of... Annoying. I feel like it's going to cause a lot of lag, though, while raiding. Like, even more lag. Because, I mean, look at that. <laughs> Just 
stupid ass monkey over there gotta be stuck will he stay stuck there or will he just get out right uh now? he got out last time once for me then the other time he just fell off the edge and i couldn't even do the boss like, i couldn't complete it i lost my kit but i mean i got the ingrams from the spider Come on, spider. The baby is hypered. Oh fuck, I fell. Bro, run. You need the Ingrams, bro. You better not die. Uh, he'll hit you from there. That means the monkey's gonna take forever. Can't see him. To her. Shut up. Actually, we can't do that. We can't justify that. 2021. Yeah. 2023, bro. Damn. I wish it was 2021. I know. Actually, it needs to be like back in 2022 or or 2020 and 2019, where gas prices were a dollar 29. I agree. <laughs> I can't deal with gas no more. Fuck you, you should see how you should see how I feel. Yeah, that's why I don't have a big ass truck. So the base is coming along really nicely. We got a lot of stuff done today. We did the boss fight as well as doing a lot of breeding. We even went over to the event. The tribe mate, the bozo, did do the dodgeball golem. I had to go to work. He actually did win. I forget what he won, but he won something from it. He won one of the events or like one of the rounds or whatnot. So the first thing we want to do today is we got to get this first pretty big skeletal tower out. We are going to have a little bit of issue because it's only 125 turret cap, but we can make it do. It's not going to be as many turrets on this as we wanted, but we'll make it work. We're going to get this started. It's going to take a little while to build. I'll speed up a little bit of it. I'll cut back when we get a lot of it done as well. So we got some pretty good PTs together. Um, we're going to raise some up just for um, C spinning and stuff because we have a little bit of raid that we plan on doing tomorrow. So hopefully we get that done. So we're going to raise some of these up. We're going to imprint them. We have over 2k um, health which is actually very insane on a PT. So we're going to continue breeding these up. We have pretty good stegos so far. We could use better carbos but um, we'll get all that later on. Stegos and PT seem to be the best thing for us right now to have anyways. So we're gonna get these going. We're gonna do a little bit of stuff around the base while we're also doing that tower outside.
Oh, very nice, very nice. I forgot how boosted the Sima Dean or the uh, Beaver Dams were. A little too boosted, but um, I mean, I'll take the electronics and Sima Dean paste and Black Pearls and crap. Why not? The electronics throw me off, but why not? We definitely need them for turret. We're going to craft up a tech chest piece and some more um, some more tech turrets. Just having that tech chest piece will actually help a lot when building this tower. So we don't have to grapple or anything as much. And we do finally have the Ingram for that. So we're going to have it, go ahead and craft that up. Um, we have pretty good BPs going. Like if we put all our points in a crafting seal, the BPs come out alright. I mean I'm pretty happy with what we have so far. So let's go ahead and try to finish some of this breeding. Finish the tower. We also need to go do an alley vein as well later on. That's funny. I <laughs> can't even wake up for your alarm saying you did most Fuck of the work. <laughs> That's actually hilarious. You're a douchebag. I just want you to know that. Accept that. Accept it. Shit. Well, can't do a floating turret there. That kind of sucks. So let me move it. You are not the one I want. Where's the 130? Where the fuck did it go? Um. Bro, get your ass over here. How you get so far? Yeah, follow me up. We had a long ways ahead of us. Come on, shake that little ass of yours and let's go. Come on. And then we gon' we gonna go right up in here. Oh yep, your dumbass jumped over and my dumbass fell to the side. Come on, wrap around. It ain't gonna fit. Shit. The walls on the side. I wasn't sure about them. I figured just to per I can't grab it. Come on. I know you fit in here. There we go. Oh, now I'm stuck. What are you doing, step bro? <laughs> oh. <laughs> um, what? This is... This is an issue. Oh, fuck. Oh, um. perfect, baby. Good shit. Alright, now we gotta de-render and get it out of aggro. And then I'll come back and tame it. Bro, there's a cave. Are you dead serious? I've n I've played this map so much. You're telling me there's a cave up here? Alright, this should be far enough. Where? Dude, literally, right down this little lid, lip right here. Uh-huh. To the left. Isn't that a rat hole? Wait a minute. That's a cave? Bro, do you know how... Goes, I think this goes into the fucking wyvern den, but I never knew this was here. Do you know how long I've played this and never knew this was a thing? Got me, 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 got me. Oh, it just exits right here. I never knew either of those were there. 
Like, I, bro, if you would just block one side of this off, this has a potential to be a nice cave for, like, a duo. It's not, that's not very well, though. Alright, well, yeah, it is, but... It's tamed. You can still put a stack over and shit through it. Bro, 243 melee. No way. For real, 1870 health, but the, oh, the melee is good. That's spot for 50k, because they come from both sides, so you can sit on the left side, I can sit on the Damn. right side, so... It's actually All right. probably... Case I still have a cryo timer, bro. I think the corrupt gigas aren't as good as regular gigas. Though, What's your melee right now? 380. Yeah, mine's 382. So am I getting this side? I don't want to go over there with the giga though. <laughs> no, we're gonna, you get which side do you want, right or left? Uh, so down here is what you're meaning? Yeah. I'll go down here. Alright, I'm not sure. Oh shit, bro. I'm walking on them and they're... Yeah, they damage. They get damage. I can't. The turn radius is so bad. Alright. Yeah, and didn't we both use both gigas and we killed it pretty quick? Yeah, we smoked it. Oh, bro. There's a spino. Uh, might do some damage to it. That spino got passed. That's fine. As long as it's still there, it's still a good good alley. Bro, why is there so many spinos? Yeah. If the Giga, if the Giga like, aggroes to you, let me know. I'll come over there and help you. Get ready for the lag, because a lot of shit spawns. Bro, it's coming from like a lot more directions than I thought you said they were. <laughs> it's, just two, it's just two ways, so it's this way and that way and then the ramp over here. So three would be ideal. Yeah, for this sure. Area, but other areas, it'll be like fucking like five areas. So it's like pretty sure. It's lagging like crazy, yeah. The wyverns are becoming an issue. Uh, this damn rock right here is pissing me off. <laughs> yeah, they're down here at the other end where that ramp is. There's a Spino and a Rex and shit. I'm just so slow when I don't have stand. Bro, I hate that it like almost one taps the little ones on the outside, so if you hit it like once, it's just gone. <laughs> 430 melee. Getting there. Nice. I'm definitely doing a meat run, which we need. Keeping all that, uh, rough nodes too. Oh, oh, is that a new round? Oh, shit. Is it really? Yeah, if Wyvern's going nuts, bro, the Wyvern's be... Dude, I hate it, because it doesn't make a noise like the OSD. Yeah. Bro, the Wyverns do mess you up, though. I'm never ready, either, so it's like... Like, I'm sitting here trying to level and get Stam, and then, like, I look back, and there's just Wyverns coming everywhere. It's lagging, too. Come on, Rex, fight me. Leave the Ellie vein alone. Yeah, 
It's already down to 30k, by the way. So I guess this Pracer right here is one of them. Is it that Spiner running down the hill? Get your ass over here, boy. God damn. Like, why they had to put this rock right here? Whatever you want to call this. Bro, I keep yeah. getting stuck on them. So, like, when I'm trying to... Because they come in from, like, up the hill and down. So, like, when I'm trying to turn... Are we at another wave? Yep. Another wave. Another wave. Pretty sure this is wave five. Yep, wave five. So, this is the last one? I think so. Hopefully. Bro, they definitely up the spinos and paracers. Holy lag. I feel like the spinos be doing a lot of damage in the wyverns. are not helping with that leg. Nice. Good shit. And we look, we saw this corner down here, the small ones too. Damn bro, I got hella poly off that too. The fucking mantis doesn't have a saddle. Nah, we don't have time either. We just use our hatchets. Does it stay here? Yeah. So it does? I thought they despawn. Uh, where's my shit at? I don't see my. Where's my bag? Oh, I see it. Uh, right next to the fountain. Yep, I get it. How much you getting now? Oh my god. Maybe see. These little ones are nice. Okay, yeah, get all those. Get all those for sure. Oh, oh there's a Thilo after you. Dude. Are they, are we getting... Dude, good pickaxe with a fucking imprinted mantis. This is going to be insane. We're never going to have to worry about Ali. It's going to be nice because uh, we... We need it. We need Ellie for all those shards. Get your bitch ass out of here. Oh, bro. Why is there Rexes? They still attack this shit? They just attacking our Giggles, which is fucking retarded. Bro, this is a tanky ass Rex. Oh, wait. There's more up there? Alright, I'll get him. Why would you fight a Giga? It's the dumbest shit. Got all the little fucking things. Uh, yeah, you good. You good to get the big boy. Ready? Yes, sir. Damn! 6,000 Ellie? What is that? Is that a hundred thousand dust? Bruh, we just gotta run like ten of those and we're set to cap all of our cap every tech we have just to be that guy. That was a shitty pickaxe. So as you can tell, we got a lot of element. We're gonna put that element to our base and also for a future raise, so stay tuned. Lock this. Bro. Alright, I ungrappled for a second. Bro, they didn't. Bro, there's shit. They really, bro. You could see that you could blow the cliff flats. <laughs> bro, what are they doing? They don't deserve to build in this spot. 
down to this. Just don't let a turret shoot. Oh, he's right there. Did you see him? He just jumped above us. <laughs> he's right there. He's coming down. <laughs> Bro, he's right there on his wall. He's trying to grapple me. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna put turrets down here now, but this is built so bad. Where do you go? PT, 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 PT. Whip. This guy is so bad. Bro, it's kind of hilarious. Stay here, PvP, free kits. <laughs> I have my Giga with me still. I could have just lie. popped it. <laughs> oh, that's a Giga. Pop yours. Hold up. Oh, his is way better, bro. Pop yours, pop yours. <laughs> We're an ass. <laughs> Look at the baby Giga. Bye bye. <laughs> Watch out for the blood soccer. He's trying to grab us off the blood soccer. Night of the blood soccer. Back up. Killed as another baby Giga. <laughs> Bro, his giga won't even push. Oh, I am. <laughs> Go one of those good, good shit. Bro, uh, they're put bro, bro, back up, back up. They're placing turrets. Run down, run down, run down. They're turning on turrets. Run down. Oh shit, I'm stuck down here now, bro. Oh no, I got up. They placed a the turret. Oh, I'm dead. So if you can grab my body, hop on the PT and just do it. Fuck your Giga. You have to. Alright, I got my Giga. You don't want me to try to get yours? I mean, you don't have to if you don't want to. I whistled it neutral. Nah, don't whistle it neutral. Nah, oh, well, fuck. They're biting it with the Giga. Whistle it back to you. Whistle it back to, like, the entrance and try to drop it down. So, did you get my body, though? Yeah, I got your body. Yeah, your Giga ain't fitting down here, bro. Oh, 
Come on, boy. Uh, maybe, maybe. Come on, it's out. Oh, nope, it's stuck. Fuck. That's mine. Leave it. I don't care. If you can, try and grab the saddle off of it. But if it's going to kill you, don't. Boy, what you mean? I got your whole ass giga. I crowded. I'm out. Oh, word. <laughs> They're so bad, bro. They're so bad. Bro, can we see spin? I could see spin with my thing For up. Sure. Actually, we might not even get a shot by doing this. You think? I die. Uh... Bro, you trust me? Oh, wait. No, there's some on the right powered. Yeah, bro, I can still right, see spin. I can still see spin that. They got a strider up there. What tribe is it? Silo. Seal? Bro, yes, raid this one now, and then we'll go hit yeah, the other guys. It. Like, yeah, this this is easy. Uh, come back down. Let's go. Yeah, I'm a, let's go back down. I'll place a bed. Is this? There's no way it's unlocked. Oh my god, it's unlocked. Oh, that's fucking amazing. I'm just uploading myself. Place a bed down. Oh, you put the bed in the most goddamn obvious place oh, possible. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> goddamn bozo. <laughs> Thanks. Hold on, let me hop on this PT and watch. I don't have much stam, though, bro. Like, I think I'm just have to go for it before I run out of stam. Nope, bro. Bro, yeah, they don't even have really much ammo. There's only one turret shooting me. Good shit. Look at that. Wow. Oh. There's one other coward. Yeah, thankfully, I have no legs, but I'm up here. I can't believe that's how I shot you though. That's pretty crazy. Yeah, it's a spawning thing. Desmos, May Wings. I really hope they have crowds. Bro, look at the fabricator. Yep. Nice. Feared Hawk. Oh, baby, triple. Oh. Griffin, Griffins. I mean, they're bad, but I don't even have a Griffin yet. They're not good. None of their stuff's good. Yeah. Maywing, Maywing, Maywing. Nice. Flak BPs. Bro, everything's unlocked. Ammo, shards. Oh, bro, they got car cars. Two hundred five. One seventy. Bloodstalker. Bloodstalkers, bro. Breed pair. Let's go. Breed pair, and they're not, they're pretty good too. Let's go, bro. That's good shit. Bro, good flak BPs. Might be better than ours, some of them. 20 heavies. Stego BP. Oh, bro, tech turrets, tech gen, tech trans, and tech rep. I don't know why they didn't place that. A good ass Stego BP. 250 element. Bruh. I'm gonna yoink some of this shit. Oh, there's another guy sleeping right here. I didn't even see him. Dude, he has a Fjorder Hawk. Yeah, that's what I said. Oh, I didn't even see that dude. Nice. Boys. Nice, bro. <laughs> this is low key, like. Back up. The kid that bought my old truck. I don't know why. Oh. Nice. I'm gonna eat him. Hold up. Why? It's a full three man.
Oh shit. I'm black boxed. <laughs> whale. Pull the metal. Wouldn't that be nice? Bro, I ain't bothering with the stegos. Oh, there's a guy up here? I know, that's where the oh. uh, dragon from. Can't you grapple anywhere up there? Fuck. How high can you go up? <gasps> what the fuck? I wasn't even touching my mouth. Did something knock me off? the video we all can't right shit out i think i'm about to get wait what that bitch just oh there we go so the goal for today is pretty simple we're gonna do a little bit of taming as you can tell but stay tuned for sure because if you remember the alpha tree from the last video we are going to go back and we are going to raid that we gave them like a day to build up not really that we gave them a day more like um kind of had stuff to do so we got off it's been like another day and they got pretty thick but there is a little bit of some downfalls in their base as you will see later in the video and we're going to take that over is the goal take it over make it our breeding base the last video you'll see us hopefully building it up because i think i got one more video after this to edit you'll see us building it up hopefully we'll also try to get as much of it set up as we can there is also some other unfortunate events that do happen in the next video that i will explain then and why the series was cut short but i think it's still going to be like a seven eight part series so hopefully you guys did enjoy the next few series coming up are going to be bangers we have a lot of good content a lot of pretty big spots that we have claimed and also of course still the solo life the duo life 
Plus, we have some Fibercraft on the way for you guys that enjoy that as well. So definitely stay tuned. If you are new around here, make sure you subscribe. Go check out Miss Yona's channel. Just get her to 1,000 subscribers. She should have a video coming out today, maybe tomorrow, depending on when I can get that up as well. I'm going to get shot by like four or five turrets, and then I'd be in. Oh, don't even ask. Loki just tamed to 140 mana. How? I knocked it out. It, it was attacking the snow owl, so I fucking tranked it out. With a fucking crossbow and you were actually able to knock it out without it running away? I netted the bitch. Oh. Okay, fair enough. 135 mal right there. Oh, I'm actually glad that one died. Alright. Knocking this now. Um, and I'm getting... Hmm. Bro, why? Bro, this crossbow be doing too much damage, I feel like. <laughs> I just could have died too. Bro, the mana passed out before this. There we go, it's down. Damn, bro, guess we don't have cryobod. So stupid. Bro, I found somebody on a PT and he's unconscious. He has hide on though. Did you uh, get back to base, brother? Let me get this free kit, boy. No, man, fuck the kit. We're about to get a fucking the whole base spot, motherfucker. <laughs> nah, he only had hide and prim tools. I'm a dumbass. All right, I'm going. Alright, so some of the first issues we had, I mean, I got kind of blurred, but honestly, I don't really care. So, we had an admin that really just kept coming over to the base consistently, just kind of like making up things. Like, we got the okay from the owner and everything to do what we're doing. Hell, the owner even watched us building, so like, built some of this. Like, he, like, literally watched me build the tower and everything. But this admin was complaining that we had our foundation snap through here, just to make it nice because we're kind of OCD. And then, you know, he just wanted to make a big deal saying that we had to change and everything. We didn't because, you know, we got the okay and it wasn't that bad. It's not like we spammed off the entire place with Cliff Platts or anything. So it was just one of those admins. Plus, it was a little suspicious because every day our base would be red gunned or it would literally just be structure wiped and we had to get to the owner to back up the server. So a lot of issues, a lot of sketchy admins. And like we've been told him, like we've played on BAM's Ark and other servers where like we've had connected foundations like this before. Nobody really cares as long as it's not excessive to where the server is going to crash. But I'm gonna stop rambling, let's get back and let's get some stuff done. Are they gonna look over here and be so salty? You didn't turn that tech turret on, by the way. Also, I do have a baby, so please bear in mind with the background sounds. I think at the time of recording this, the baby was only like seven, eight months. So bear with that. There's going to be some baby noises here and there while the mom is doing dishes, while the wife, um, or playing with their little brother or little sister. So bear with the baby noises, you know, can't really help it. I don't close my door. I leave my door open, you know, just in case they need anything. Or sometimes I will take, I have a gaming laptop that sometimes I record on. I will take it to the kitchen. I will literally sit at the table if the wife is at work or something. If I have a little bit of spare time, I do play. And while they're playing, watching TV, taking naps and stuff. So bear with me with some of the noises. I do apologize, but there's nothing I can do about that. I am a father, so I do have kids. And you're going to hear occasionally some kids in the background. No. I don't see anything. I don't see any movement, but... With the fucking tech shit, it's kind of hard to see. I don't... I... Reaper I'm is on a uh, logged out up top I'm in. still. I'm in. You're in? Yeah, oh, you got through that corner? Bro, get I'm that tech gen down ASAP. Where is it? I don't I know. Can't. I think there's more than one, I, I bet, for that. See it. Bro, get that down now. Bro, they left that whole ass corner open. Like, how dumb can you be? I can't get it. Why can you not get it? Oh, it's on a fuck. What am I doing? Fuck. Is it just one tech gen on the whole base? I don't think so.
Better get ready, bro. I'm grabbing my Giga. Yeah, there's still so many turrets up. You got like the like five hatcherings down over on the left, but like it's up towards the right somewhere. Like, up towards the top. So there's internals. Yeah, there's internals. Um I, I have think about this for a second. I have a stego, but I don't see any shot of me getting in there. You don't think you could see spin, dude? Bro, you see how quick my other one died? Yeah, but I, I can try it. I'll never say I mean, never. I'll put everything up. Bring one stego with me. I'm in. No way, bro. I'm in. See? I'm in. Let's go. Here, take this stego. Just dropped it. Got the bitch, got the bitch. Um, I got nothing on me, though. I ain't got a giga or nothing now. I'm going to need you to use the stego because it's imprinted to you. Oh, yeah, you good. Can I come in here? Yeah, you're good. Everything's good. Where do Just I throw go... the stego out? Yeah, throw Where... out the stego and walk up them stairs. There's no tech, so you won't get shot off. It's just heavies. So I can walk face first, you think? Yeah, you should be able to. And I mean, if you want to take the safer, I'll go back. Is he on, though? I, d I mean, we're in his base, so I highly doubt it. Wait, do you have grapples or no? Yeah. Here, throw them in there real quick. I want to see something. Do you have a crossbow? You're good. Continue what you were doing. Alright, I'm... Hold on. This is fucking doing that leveling motion. I'm tanking this bitch. Bro, I this see the so tech gen underneath that uh, cliff plot over there. I see the bubble shit. So if we can get yep. these soaked real quick. This is our base spot, people. We shouldn't have moved in. Wouldn't have this issue. I have veggie um, cakes in it. It's at 10k though. I only have eight veggie cakes. Bro, that fucking sucks. Why do you have so much C4 there? I wonder how much ammo. I mean, these veggie cakes are going to heal it up a little bit, but how much health does it have left? I don't even know if you're doing any damage to that. that. Should have brought my other, um, my other stego now that I'm thinking about it. Bro, as soon as this is down, we gotta get beds, get them all killed, and then, yeah. You still have a bunch of C4 scrap to this as well. I know, I'm, I, it's just there for insurance. <laughs> but don't blow it, because I'm under it. <laughs> I really hope these turrets can't shoot me at the generator. I hope not, bro, because no. we gotta, okay, we gotta get that down. We're so close, and we didn't have to even soak the outside, so that ammo out there is all profit. Why would they leave that spot open? Like, why would they not block that off? Uh, it's a little bit over, ain't it? Oh, what the- oh, well. Well, that just fucked everything all up. I forgot I had C4 plate. <laughs> There's no shot we're gonna be able to get that now. One of the bozo's boziest of moves. After telling him multiple times that there's C4 there and he knows he forgets to pick the C4 up, blows it, it opens up the wall. So now it's gonna be a fun time to work around that. He is the bozo for a reason. You did actually have a sadder on it, but it says it's zero health and I'm lagged. There we go. Bro, you blew a whole ass hole in that bitch. Oh, oh dude, there is a massive ass hole. Holy fuck. Oh, I don't know. Actually, no. Yeah, 
Yeah, I would just stay right there. <laughs> A little bit of stress, not gonna lie. I didn't even bring my other damn stay go, so. We're made boosted, so you're good. Alright, I'm back at. I physically my body is. cannot move because there's a turret looking right at me, and I don't know how I'm not getting shot. That I should stay on my PT. So I can go to where my stego is, you think? Yeah. Alright, I'm on my stego. It only has 30k. How's it going? Where are you? Um. I have a really crazy but really smart and stupid idea hmm. that I think it'll work and I think I can get the last generator down by doing this. Hmm. 46 second. Fuck off, yeah. Dude, I'm like shaking and I'm tired and I'm hungry and I'm fucking... Hungry. Yeah, bro, I'm, I'm starving, Loki. I'm starving. Dude, I'm literally running off my steam right now. Yeah, I feel it, bro. I'd be able to get to bed, though. No, I can't. Okay, well, that's just gonna have to wait until I get the generator down. Yeah, just get that gen down so I can go back, get the Giga, meat run their shit, get them dead, so they can't come back and... I mean, they still come back, but you know, you know what I mean. Are you able to get the tech gen? Are you getting it? Are you only doing 14 damage? That can't be the tech gen. <laughs> That's probably Whoa. the cliff blood. Bro, at this point, why don't we just drop the cliff plat? We don't have the C4 for that. We're getting the gen. We win. Come on, come on, come on. Get it down, boy. Get it down, Bobby. Come on, tech psycho body, just stay open, just stay fucking here for just get 10 that more seconds. down, so I go get my damn Giga. Almost down, almost down, almost down, almost down. I'm instantly getting my Giga, and I'm just gonna start eating everything. Dude, this is taking so long to break. It's because we get that prem tech rifle. We need to do some red OSTs. Come on, get it Boom. down. Everything's down. Oh, yeah, let's go. All right, going to get Stego. All right, Giga. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait. Yeah, everything's down. That's you shooting again. I was about yeah, to say. Just, I'm breaking beds right now. Nice. About I to start meat right running. Now, yeah. I look cryopod. Cryos. Dude, the amount of element they have. They have Sorry about the leg. Ready. No, you're good. Let her eat.
So this fire guy was saying that everybody was cheating, trying to bait him to Sanctuary East. Later on, you'll see that he actually gets banned because he is aimbotting. So he's pretty much just spending his to come to get our kids. He does find us down here, and then you will see what happens later on, you know. Sadly, this game is getting ran by cheaters and people with aimbot and, you know fucking pts just instant turn and shit and it's just it's getting ridiculous but another crazy thing is the whole gear that the guy was wearing was crafted by the admin earlier that was messing with us so it's all a little suspicious i don't know but it is what it is let's get this raided it's finished looting let's try to get this cleared out and then we're gonna eventually move in here and claim this as our breeder spot thing the pace 1200 more element 15,000 shards they about to help us set this base up why is it so laggy uh, i don't know probably admin red gunning our base honestly probably i'm gonna oh be surprised oh my fucking nasty fucking long neck blueprint two of them oh bro and we even got mana bp yeah you can take all that shit dude stego blueprint the Giga? Bro, Mantis, Mantis. Let's go. Just gonna start yoinking some shit. Uh, Anglerfish, Rhino, Velo. Blueprints, more than that. Might as well just yoink them for now. Damn. Oh my god. They Loaded. Thick. Pyros. Pyros. Hi, I'm slot capped. I'm gonna throw it in your bozo tranodon. Seventeen K. Uh, lightning went, uh, ew, 95. I'll take that raw meat, though. Fucking admin, like go fuck off. Why do you keep following me? He keeps going in the mesh and shit. I think we meshed. Oh, yeah, I definitely meshed. <laughs> Stupid yeah, asses. Yeah. Let's be lows up the yin yang. Our v lows, sadly. Are they any better than ours, though? Don't look like it. Uh, we got another snow owl female too. 3.2k health. Nice. Take those cryos. We can just throw them velos on our towers if we wanted to. Yup. They had a carno on a raptor. Yeah. Bruh. I and I kind of, I think I figured out why they were taking this polymer. Why, um, that whole wall dropped. Why? Because it used large walls. Ah. Uh, makes sense. Bye, guys. Yo. But he's not floating around like a damn. Where is he? Yeah, he's sniping the shit. Oh, no. Nah, he's aimbotting. He straight up hit nothing. But he aimbotting. If you guys watched last video, you would have seen that we're taking over Alpha Tree. Well, sadly, this guy in the last video kept calling people out. Every time somebody went to the location he wanted, he was an aimbotter and then just a bunch of other things. So yeah, we are getting aimbotted by this guy. And it was also suspicious that the admin, like everything that he had was crafted by the admin that also kept messing with us in previous videos. So yeah, just a bunch of random shit happening. 
Yeah, that shit was crafted by the admin <laughs> ace that he was wearing too. Oh, the turrets, the turrets are down. Turrets are nice. Down, yep. Blow that shanty. We get all that ammo too. I don't think 99% of them probably didn't even shoot me. Oh, for real? Well, I don't say. Well, I wouldn't say 99% of them. I say probably about like probably about 50% didn't shoot me. The other 50 probably did. Nice. So, yeah. so that's all done. Well, this is our spot now. What are these bags over by this incubator? Oh, incubators, May wings. Oh. Uh, fire wavers. And that one looks like it's empty, so. I'm stuck in your Giga's foot for some fucking reason. <laughs> Bro, there's a lot of cliff plots I gotta clear. Yeah, a lot there's... of C4 and shit. Because we don't have mech, and I definitely ain't Arthur on this, so I'll just take the time to C4 it. Um, Definitely think I'm gonna take a quick break to eat. I hope somebody don't go well, actually no They had to clear this out before they yeah, I think And I don't think this tribe's gonna come back over and rebuild No, If I were you I would just literally did you grab everything off that guy's body? Yeah, I should there should be some c4 on his body. No, there's not No, okay. no there's some stuff missing Oh. Probably just despawned it if you do. I'll make some C4. I'll probably just drop the wall real quick and then I'm gonna eat some food. Actually, I'm gonna leave my Giga over here. Honestly, I would just drop the Shandy. Drop the Shandy and then. Oh no. Nah, no, I'm gonna wall. drop that wall too. This foundation's up there and shit. Alrighty. Well, I'm gonna fucking hit the hay finally. Sounds good. Well, we did it. It's not as stacked as I thought they'd be, but no, hey, better than I know, nothing, I'm man. I'm disappointed with that, but better than it's nothing. It's still nice that we got rid of him. Now we can take the spot. Yeah, for sure. So the goal is we're going to go ahead and try to clear all of this out. We are going to make this our breeder base. So it did take us a little while to raid it, but we honestly was able to dive behind their wall. So definitely go check out the last video. I know a lot of you guys did not see it. I don't know what happened. YouTube kind of screwed me on that video. Seemed like nobody actually got notified or maybe it just wasn't interesting. I know that later on in series, like, you know, when you get to the six, seven episodes, it seems like you guys just stop watching so i don't know if you guys just don't like the late game stuff as much but this is the last video of the series then we got some fresh stuff coming some day one content all that good stuff coming in a whole nother series we also have the fibercraft stuff uh, coming i see a lot of you guys saying you missed the fibercraft videos they're not going anywhere i just took a little break for the people that don't enjoy them as much i'm gonna keep bring those back occasionally just maybe every few days upload one because i am still trying to go daily for you guys it is sometimes a little difficult to do daily but i do have quite a bit of footage saved up to the point where i can do daily for you guys and i kind of just you know go day by day and whatever i do that day i upload as long as it's good enough so hopefully you guys do enjoy this type of content but with that being said make sure you guys hit that like button make sure you subscribe make sure you go check out miss yona's channel she should have just uploaded a video or it comes out in like a half hour after this which is the possibility. So she's uploading again today. So definitely go subscribe. Let's get her to 1,000 subscribers. I'm going to stop rambling on. And with that being said, let's get this cleared out.
the tribe did end up getting back on. He actually has a blood soccer, but um, I'm just kind of poking my head through trying to figure out the situation. But we're going to PvP him, get him out of here so we can clear the rest of this so we can take this over. I just said I'm going to get picked with a blood soccer, and I'm trying to see if he's the only one. But we're going to PvP, see if we can get him out of here. Once we kill this, though, I don't think he has anything else. He probably just had that in upload or something like that. All right, I'm just uh, placing the turrets. Clone or tech strike is gonna be actually kind of impossible, I think. A tech strike? Oh, uh, yeah, can you even get those? Like, well, very often, because there's no gen. Yeah, it's probably gonna be impossible. I'm glad I got that in that PC bundle they were doing for the people that couldn't get on because I don't even know if you're going to be able to find any Blood doctors aren't going to be possible I was honestly really happy how this side of the wall came out. Granted, you have to realize we've never built here before and the turret cap was very low on this server. So I never personally built here. I know on the other side um, we're going to do the hanging hatch frames and all that. But we honestly never got around to it because we had a lot of issues with the a certain admin or admins. I don't know. Every day we'd log in, our base would be red gunned, uh, destroyed, something to do. You know, we never literally got raided. It was just always a red gun. We had issues with admins and things like that. Overall, the server really wasn't that bad. Um, 
Admins just could not be trusted. Somehow the admin password like constantly got leaked apparently is the excuse. I don't know. I don't understand it. But um, I was pretty happy with the build. I had an amazing time playing. You know, this is um, a fun series for you guys putting in the Southgate rat hole. And I hope you guys did enjoy. But um, after we got off this night, the servers went down. Um, and then, you know, the time we got back on, our stuff was red gunned or like our base was just like auto destroyed, whatever you want to call it with an admin command again. And at that point we decided to move on and stop playing. We didn't really care at that point. It was just getting frustrated. So sadly that's where the series is going to end. But, um, let me know how I did with the alpha tree. I've never built here, but I think the, uh, I think that it came out pretty good, but make sure you like subscribe. And as you can tell, yeah, it was just, everything was killed, but like, subscribe, and I will catch you guys in the next video. Hopefully you guys, guys all have an amazing day, night, wherever it is for you guys, and peace.